How's it going guys, Avatrix here, and today I'm coming to you with uh, an update of where I am right now. Uh, I know that I haven't been making a lot of videos lately, but it's because I have a lot of family over for quite a bit of time, so I don't really have enough time to sit down and make any sort of videos because we're uh, going to parks and all this other stuff, you know, so that's basically why. Um, but as you can probably already see, I have my sixth hero base already, so... I uh, went ahead and put my Thunder God there for mainly raids and dungeons. And here's where my Immortip is at. Uh, almost at 130. So he's getting up there. I have enough HP to get him up uh, to 8 stars right away. And I'm already currently saving up to get all of my 9 star heroes. Uh, oops. Which, they're still kind of far away. But since I'm, since I'm getting about 30,000 uh, HP a day, uh, not really too much of a problem. Um, now, as far as the shards uh, and my pumpkin duke, here's where we're at. Yep, that's right. I'm about a thousand five hundred shards away from my goal, which was twenty-five thousand, which is basically to get pumpkin duke up. Um, now, as you can already see, pumpkin duke already has some experience, so I probably don't even need to get uh, the twenty-five thousand. Um, probably can already do it. But I don't want to. I don't want to spoil it. You know, I'll just probably wait till the end. Um, now, since I did get the six hero base, I actually did he have to use about a thousand shards to go ahead and rush my druid up to five of nine. So, honestly, I probably should have already been done. But because of that, uh, my six hero base, I wanted druid to heal everybody, so I had to rush that. So that's where we're at right now. Now, so let's go ahead and do some quick dungeons here with this six hero base and see how this this works out for me. Now, like I mentioned before, I'm using Thunder God just for mainly raiding and uh, and dungeons in the six hero base. Um, I probably would use him also for here be monsters in place of maybe uh, like uh, Spirit Mage. Replace Spirit Mage with um, with Immortep. Just because Immortep is a little better than Spirit Mage. Um, yes, Spirit Mage is ranged, um, but Immortep, the AoE, is just so much better than just a few balls. And, yeah, I mean, it uh, it doesn't seem like it's done much faster, but the good thing about it, uh, on my perspective, is since I'm using Thunder God now, that's an even a, a higher chance that that Spirit Mage will be taken out before my heroes get there. Before I usually rely on that um, the Spirit Mage proc with the magic missile but now I can also rely on Thunder God proc and ride on that Spirit Mage so let's see let's see who's gonna proc on that, on that Spirit Mage. Place your bet right now let's see. Is it Spirit Mage or is it gonna be Thunder God? Oh it was the Spirit Mage. Did you guess right? Alright so um, with the 6 hero base I noticed that um, as far as raiding and dungeons and everything, it just becomes way too easy to the point where uh, it's almost guaranteed that there's there's got to be some other dungeon coming soon because right now it just doesn't stack up. I get the drop, which is kind of surprising. Um, now, I also wanted to um, to start trying out new bases for uh, Here Be Monsters Age. So if you have any suggestions on bases or anything like that, definitely let me know. That way I can try some things out. I'm actually, as, as you can see here, I'm actually trying to get my hero bases up as soon as possible. Uh, my goal is to get to 17. That because that's where they get that extra range and of course every level counts for 2% on defense and everything of, of their stats so it counts so my goal there is just to get to 17 and then I'll start working on my towers which uh, my main goal for that would be level 9 um, because that's where they get the extra range and fr quite frankly the difference from level 9 and level 10 isn't really that big of a difference so f once I'm done with that, then I'll start getting on my gold vaults to 18. Um, mainly because of the HP, but also because they look sick. I, I really love their look. When you run into a level 18 base that has all gold, and you're just like, jackpot. I want to have that look. But yeah, um, this is basically just a video um, letting you know where I'm at. Uh, when I get to that 25,000, I'll be making another video showing when uh, when I get that uh, that pumpkin duke up to eight or nine. Now, because I barely have any room in my altar, I'll probably just get them close and then show you guys the last bit 
that way you know you don't have to sit through that that painful grind of just hiring two and etc etc so yeah so that's it for this video guys uh, definitely leave a like and subscribe if you haven't and definitely uh, stay in touch because w the next video that I'll be putting out will be when some once I'm done okay but until later guys bye